one. October 2nd, 5.20 p.m. at this Michaels store in Aspen Hill, Maryland. The sniper fired his first shot. In the next 17 hours, the sniper would attack five more times. So is it possible that the significance of this first shooting would be overlooked in all the chaos? There is a possibility that the police may have overlooked the first crime scene to some degree. John Beza is a former New York City homicide detective. One investigator has even theorized that this first shot could have been a message from the sniper. If it was a message, if that's the case, then more than likely the message would have been towards the Michael store. Experts say that in the beginning, the sniper may have been more emotional, possibly revealing his true motive or leaving more clues. If it had been a little bit lower, a little bit more to the right, it would have been me. And Chapman works in Michaels. The sniper's shot missed her by inches. The lone shot struck the glass in the front of the store about seven feet high. Just after the incident, she talked to us about her close call. All we heard was this loud bang, bunch of ringing, and nobody could hear anybody because our ears were all clogged with ringing. It was scary, and I'm just glad I was safe because I could have been number one. But today, Ann wonders why the police haven't questioned her more thoroughly. Are you surprised by the fact that the police have not been back to talk to you and the other employees there? Yeah, I yeah. am. You know, I don't know if we can offer them anything and all, but time has gone by. We have had time to think about things and all, so maybe someone knows something else or whatever, you know, but I, I'm, I'm just surprised. And the manager of the store said despite the fact that the police were in the parking lot today, they did not talk to him. Although they may have thought they investigated good the first time, they may have to re-interview people, go back there, go back there at the same time that the shot was fired at. Today, we asked Montgomery County Police Chief Charles Moon.